Good morning, Britain. Wake, Wake up, sleepyheads. <laughs> So, Bridget, who have we got on the show today? It's someone oh, special, isn't oh, it? Oh, it's very exciting. Absolutely, mm. yes. He's so handsome. Right. He's a novelist. Yes, he is. And his name is Tom Dingle. Tom Dingle. And he's sitting right here. Yes. Hi, Tom. How are you? Yes, uh, Thank you for having me. Uh, Tom, your, um, your book, The Lonesome Dove, has been such a success yes, in the UK. Quite a success. Um, why mm. do you think that is? Mm. Um, that's a tough one. Um, I, I think it's because it brings back the notion of, of courting and, and, and true romance. It's that makes sense. Right, yes, yes, it does. Oh, you know, what gave you the idea of your two main characters, mm. Demetrius and Molly, yes. communicating oh. by a, a dove? dove. Oh, okay. Well, I'm an avid bird watcher, and oh, the dove so represents oh, yes, so is. many aspects of life and history. Oh. So uh, yeah, I, I yes. chose the dove because it's the symbol of love, and peace, and messengers. Oh, oh. Fabulous. It's fascinating. Isn't it very Just fascinating? fascinating. Now, I hear you're hopping across the pond to America. Uh, yes, um, I'm actually spending the next few months in Los Angeles. Uh, I'm meeting my new literary agent and I'm just doing a few book signings. Oh, well, you know what? I, I hope they don't adapt your book into some awful Hollywood cliché movie, you know, like, like they did with, with that, 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 that Alice in Wonderland. Spit it out, darling, spit oh, it out. Oh, there was quite... It was quite horrifying. Really? Uh, I assure you, uh, I would never let that happen. I, I wouldn't want to let down my fans. Of course oh, not. oh no, I didn't mean to imply. I know you wouldn't, Tom. Absolutely you're a, not, you're Tom. You're a good boy. Yeah, Tom. like you're going to pass up a movie deal. Right. Yes. Yeah, don't you shush me, you I, old I cow. Do whatever. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Sorry, Tom. Shut Sorry, she gets like I'm, this. Just... Tom, I am certainly glad that, that, that you have more manners than the impotent prick sitting next to me who won't shut. Well, f you, Bridget. Well, f you back, Rupert. Well, f me. Yes. Oh, I should be so lucky. You probably want to f him, don't you? Yes, Anyone I but would. me. How? Absolutely well, stupid. Well, well um, spit it out we wish. Me. Oh, shut up. Just get on Just with it, will you? Shut up. Thank you for coming on the show, uh, and and good luck. Thank you for having me. You, Tom, just your stupid little glasses and your funny little hair, and just look, look how sweet you are. Oh yes, you're so lovely. Well, my husband is quite awful, isn't he? But now we're well rid of him. So, um, an Englishman in Los Angeles, an, an Englishman in LA. Mm -hmm.